तो गत सप्ताह है वर्ग है अभवत सो दिस इज द सेंटेंस या रीडिंग सो या दैट्स ट्रू आल्सो गत सप्ताह है वर्ग अभवत तो तस्य समय तत समय गृह पाठ आसीत मोस्ट ऑफ यू हैव डन इट वेयर वाज इट यह सा यद्यपि तथा शैत्यम बहु हुआ वाज इट इन दिस बुक और डिफरेंट वन द होमवर्क नमस्कार महोदय द होमवर्क वाज नॉट इन द बुक नॉट इन द बुक नॉट इन द बुक ओके एनी क्वेश्चंस अबाउट द होमवर्क आतप आतपत्र आतप इज द हीट ऑफ द सन सूर्य से आतप है चंद्र कि चंद्र चंद्रिका सो आतप आतप पुलिंग आतपत्र सो दरोज यद्यपि सूर्य अस्ति तथा प्रकाश नास्ति सेंटेंस रिमेम्बर आतपत्र 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 इज यूज बिकॉज इट प्रोटेक्ट इज एड टू इंडिकेट प्रोटेक्शन टू समथिंग इज एड पुत्र that altra is also for protection is also because punnam naraka trayate iti putra 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 is the one who protects the generation oh, generation means uh, oh, of his kulam what what is in english what is called his family <coughs> his clan uh, clan from uh, uh, narak punnama narakat uh, naraka named narakam named pun put, put so putra that's why it's called putra at least he's supposed to do that by his good deeds <coughs> आतपत्र कमिंग एज आतप इज हिट सन सीट एंड देन या इट इज तप इज देर तप इज इंडिकेटिंग हिट आतप आज जन समाइम्स यूज आज उपसर्ग समाइम्स यूज फॉर टू इंडिकेट समथिंग मोर so atapa a lot of heat so it's a sun seed so atapa tra tra means one which protects atapa tra so atapa trayate from the heat of the sun it protects us so it's called atapatram which is an umbrella so we are not using patra here so atapa plus tra Similarly, we can use like a uh, rusty tr. If something is protecting you from rusty, you can use rusty tr. Similarly, as well as chhatra, with that tr also be protecting something. Yeah, could be. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All of may not be like that. But 
then that is it. Oh, thank you, sir. And there is a Kalatra also. Kalatra or Kalatra. Mm. If you don't want to use a lot, it's Kalatra. Kalatram is, it's an Aponsakaranga word. Kalatram is Bharya, Patni. Mm. And I took, I can, I don't know what is that. Tra means that, but just if I. Kalatram, Kalatram is Aponsakaranga for wife. Okay. Yadya Pitatapi Vidyo Tahaparyantam is saw the next one, this done. Gata Agami and Va are the same. Parantu Kila Prayana Nishchayena. Tra Rama Vadati Ume. Bhavati adya karya layam agachati kila. So these parantu kila prayana nishchayena. These are used as avayams. Which means parantu in, if you see the examples here. Ume bhavati adya karya layam agachati kila. Kila is used in multiple senses, uh, meanings. So uh, kila here is used, many times it is used for emphasizing what is known or underlining what is known. Uh, so here if it is, Rama is asking, Ume, Bhavati Adya Karyalayam Agachati Kila. You come to the, you come to the workplace or the office, right? So it's like Kila. So this means Bhavati Adya Karyalayam Agachati. Uma comes to the office every day, so just to make sure, is that right? Like the killer. So Rame, Uma Vadati, Rame, Adhyaham Prayena Karyalayam Nagachami. Now here Prayena, probably. Prayena is probably here. Rame, Adhyaham Prayena Karyalayam Nagachami. Probably I won't come to the office. Bhavati, Kimartham evam vadati. So why do you say like this? Evam. If you have not got this before. Evam. Like this. Evam means like this. Vavati kimartham evam vadati. Mama. Uma vadati. Mama arogyam tavat samyak nasti. So this tavat we saw before. So tavat samyak nasti. Tavat means that much. So here we are not using like a yavat tavat here, not as a pair, uh, like until sense, but here just like a tavat means uh, that much. It's a way I'm here. Mama arogyaha, arogyam tavat, or it, uh, tavat samyak, or it can be considered a, not a way as a naponsukalinga padam, tavat samyak nasti, that much. Not good. Hmm. Paranto chinta nasti. Paranto. Here, yeah, paranto is used. Uh, what is the meaning here? Paranto chinta nasti. But, paranto, but, chinta nasti. Uh, no worries. Chinta nasti. But, no worries. My health is not that great. But no worries. Rama, Rama, her friend says, Vaidyam nishchayena pashyatu. Vaidyam, uh, Vaidya is doctor. Vaidyam nishchayena, certainly. So here nishchayena coming again uh, as a, in the sense of certainly. So prayena, it was probably. Nishchayena, certainly. Vaidyam nishchayena pashyatu. Then, Uma. Tat, tat na avashyakam. Tat, that, na, no, not, avashyakam, necessary. So, avashyakam, you are using as necessary here. That is not necessary. 
श्वः निश्चयेन कार्यालय आगमिष्यामि टुमारो सटनली आई कम टू द ऑफिस जस्ट बट परंतु बट प्रायण प्रबली निश्चयेन सटनली किल जस्ट टू एज अ क्वेश्चन यार sometimes it is it, not always a question so even if you say if you don't use a question bhavati or a question tone there bhavati atya karyalayam agachati kila athwa another example is um, if you are telling somebody uh, himalaye uh, himam bhavati kila himam bhavati kila so it's not a question we are just stating the obvious and telling the person statement himalaye himam bhavati kila so there is there will be snow in the himalayas certainly that's what in the sense of emphasizing what is already known kila is used Hmm. So, paranto, any want to do any for many sentences using paranto, prayana, nischayana. Yeah, there will be no. हम प्रायेण संस्कृत वर्गम ना आगच्छामि आगामी सप्ताह आगामी सप्ताह आगामी सप्ताह मम संस्कृत पठन प्रायण न आगछा संस्कृत पठन न संस्कृत वर्ग न आगछा पर अद्य प्रायण अस्माक अंतिम वर्ग दट इज मै सेंट पर बट अद टुडे अस्माक अंतिम वर्ग लास्ट क्लास Huh? May I make a sentence with yes. some other? Yeah. Um, Aham samskritam vakyam karomi, parantu vyakaranam. Lot of mistakes. I don't know what to say. Vyakaranam? As nasty. The vyakaranam is grammar. <coughs> संस्कृतवाक्यम करोमि और रचयामि और वदामी रचयामी हम्म परंतु दोषाहा भवन्ति दैट इज अ फर्स्ट लेवल सिंपल सेंटेंस देन यू कैन ऐड मेनी परंतु दोषाहा बहवः भवन्ति बहव बहवः बहळा हम्म बहुहु लाइक बहु बहव 
भोचन बहव बहव दोषाहो नॉट ऑफ मिस्टेक्स हैपन बहव दोषा व्याकरण दट इज फाइन बहव व्याकरण दोषा महोदय If you want to separate, you can say vyakaranasya dosha, bhava ha vyakaranasya dosha ha bhavanti. Hmm. Okay, next one we have some abhyasa here. Exam. Oops. So this. We'll see later. Let's finish the next lesson also, so we can be done with the. There is no next lesson. That was the last one. No, there is. Don't worry. Yata ha, ata ha. These are because and therefore. Yata ha, ata ha. This is again a pair. Avem. मम ग्रह दूर अस्ते अतः अहम विलंबेन आगछा सो फिलुक द फर्स्ट सेंटेंस अतः मीन दे फोर मम गृह दूर अस्त मै हाउस इज फार अवे अतः अहम दे फोर आई कम लेट नो इफ यू वॉन्ट इफ यू कैन यूज बिकॉज राइट इन इन प्लेस ऑफ I come late because my house is away. So that you can say. So aham vilambe na agachami. That is the first part. Yata ha mama gham dura masti. This you can say. Now you can use yata ha yata ha together in one sentence also. You can say yata ha mama gham dura masti. Yata ha aham vilambe na agachami. अनदर एग्जांपल है अद्य विराम धनमस्ते अतः पुत्र न पठति सो टुडे इज या सो टुडे इज अ हॉलिडे देयरफॉर पुत्र न पठति इफ यू टर्न दिस अराउंड पुत्र न पठते यतः अद्य विराम धनमस्ते सन इज नॉट रीडिंग बिकॉज बिकॉज टुडे इज अ ब्रेक डे So in uh, the Malay Bengali case also, you can use something if you are reason something. Agrima sapta hai, mama gru hai, sam karya krama bhavati, atah prayana ham vargam na agachami. Okay, Jai Mohde. Any other example you want to do here? Any other sentence? मम संस्कृत हाउ से मो मोर मो इट डिपेंड्स अगेन मेक द फुल सेंटेंस फर्स्ट आई वांट टू स्टडी मोर संस्कृत I want okay. to study more Sanskrit. Hmm. Therefore, hmm. I would like to join second level. How do we say it? Hmm. Aham, uh, first part. Aham. So, if you remove first, remove more there. Okay. So these are the steps. Actually, I am trying to write some notes or tips for writing. Forming the sentences. Mm-hmm. So the main basic approach is that 
we need to take out those extra things, words, and first come arrive at the basic sentence. So in, in your case, here in this case, basic sentence is, uh, <clears throat> I want to study Sanskrit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. More we can add later. So if that, can, can that be formed? Can you form that sentence? Mama Sanskritam Katham. No, no, Aham, Aham. Aham. Hmm. Aham Sanskritam Pathami means I, I read Sanskritam. Patitum Ichami. I want to say Patitum Ichami. Patitum Ichami. Patitum. That we have studied. Tum. Two. Patitum Ichami. I want to read. I wish to read Sanskritam. Now we want to add Adhik, Adhik, that is more. Adhik, Aham, Adhikam Sanskritam Patitam Achami. No, I want to read more Sanskritam. Adhikam. Ataha, Agrima Vargam Agantum Achami. So level to chatra you can just take that away. Agrima Vargam. Next. Uh, next course. Agrima Vargam. Agantum Ichami. Agrima Agrima Vargam means next class. Uh, next. So there Agrima Varga I made a single single word, but if you want to make it two words then it becomes a visheshanam. Agrimam Vargam. Agrimam Vargam Agantum Agantum Ichami. <coughs> hmm. uh, Mahodaya cannot can it be dve, dve Varga uh, for second? Dvitiya. 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 Second. Uh, Dve means only two. Two. No, if you add two and number two and the vargam. No, number two. Dvitiya. Dvitiya. Second. Dvitiya we want vargam. second. Dvitiyam. Dvitiya vargam or dvitiyam vargam. Second class. Or if you want to say level, so here we say step, like a sopanam. Vitiya sopanam patitum ichami. Okay, next we have Yadi Tarhi. So this yadi tarhi, these are used as a pair again, like uh, yadyapi tathapi, yahasaha, tatha tatha, like that. Yadi tarhi, mostly, and sometimes you might find tarhi only, which is okay, but yadi is understood there. But these are used as a pair with if them. It's like English when we say, here it, if you read, then you will pass. So, but many times casually we use, uh, you read, then you'll pass. Uh, so, yadi bhavan pathati tarhi uttiranaha bhavishyati. No, bhavishyati coming in the future tense. Yadi bhavan pathati, if you read, yadi, if you read, tarhi uttiranaha bhavishyati. Can you turn this into a Srilinga sentence, first one? Yadi bhavan pathati tarhi uttiranaha bhavishyati. Can you change that to Srilinga? Hmm. Mangala bhagin. Yadi, yadi bhavati patati tarhi Uttirna should become Uttirna. Yes. Uttirna Bhavishyati. Yes. Okay. Uttirna Bhavishyati. Hmm. Yadi Bhavati Patati Tarhi Uttirna Bhavati. 
ಭವಿಷ್ಯತಿ ಯದಿ ಭವತಿ ಪಠತಿ ಯದಿ ಭವತಿ ಪಠತಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಉತ್ತೀರ್ಣ ಭವಿಷ್ಯತಿ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಯದಿ ಗುರು ಆಗಚ್ಛತಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಪಠನ ಭವತಿ means... one who has passed yeah. oh. so here the here the translation is not exactly li- literal but uttirna means one who has passed so you can somebody can pass the examination or somebody can pass the test or even if somebody can pass pass means cross over right actually here is a cross over cross to another side successfully like we can somebody even if he crosses a river we can see uttirana hmm. then the yadi guru agachati tarhi pathanam bhavati then the next one yadi mitrani griham agachanti tarhi pustakam pathamaha otherwise no ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಯದಿ ವೃಷ್ಟಿ ಭವತಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಜನ ಜಲ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ನುವಂತೆ ಮೆನಿ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಯುಂಟು ಮೇಕ್ ಮಾಶಾರದ ಯುಂಟು ಟ್ರಾಯ್ ಯದಿ ಯದಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಓಕೆ ಐ ಥಿಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಯಾದಿ ಭೋಜನ ಚರಾಹಿ ದಿ ಗ್ರೋಸರಿ ಸ್ಟೋರ್ ಅಗಾಮಿ ಜನ ಐ ಗೋ ಟು ದ ಗ್ರೋಸರಿ ಸ್ಟೋರ್ If so I, I food, food. I want food. Hmm. So the Yadi, Bojlam, um, then Tahari, Store, I don't know that word, and then uh, Gacha Me. So where is the if then in that sentence? If and then. So you want to say if I want food? Yeah. Hmm. if i want food then i go to the shop yes again that grocery and etc which are not necessarily i mean if we know the words and all that we can add but if we, if we don't know the words that is not necessary here we can just say go to the shop if i want food uh, i go to then i go to the store yes so yadi aham yadi so we want yadi for the if yadi aham uh, bhojanam ichami oh ichami yeah yadi aham bhojanam ichami tarhi tarhi shop what is the word for shop mm. aapanam hmm aapanam 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 ಆಪಣ ಇಸ್ ದ ಪುಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಆಪಣ ಆಪಣ ಪುಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಸೊ ಯದಿ ಅಹಂ ಭೋಜನ ಇಚ್ಛಾಮಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಆಪಣ ಗಚ್ಛಾಮಿ ಅಷ್ಟು so next hmm. 
So the next part here is chet, no chet. So if you see the first example here, Bhavan Patati Chet Uttiranah Bhavishyati. So Bhavan Patati Chet. So here it's, it's coming as if here. But here it is, uh, or like in case. No? But it is added, it is coming after. Uh, whereas Yadi was coming before, like Yadi he, Yadi Guru Hu Agarchati, like that. But here Bhavan Pathati Chet. So the order is important here, like Chet Bhavan Pathati is not like that. Bhavan Pathati Chet, if you, Bhavan Pathati means, if you, Bhavan Pathati means you read, Chet is coming later. In that case, so, what does totally it means? So Bhavan Pathati Chet means in case you read Uttiranaha Bhavishyati means same thing, same sentence what was there before written in a different way. Yadi Bhavan Pathati Tarhi Uttirana Bhavishyati was the sentence here. The same sentence is written here with the chet here. So chet is a replacement or alternate for yadi and tarhi. So where chet is used, we do not use yadi and tarhi pair totally. We just use one word, chet. This is important to know. So when you use chet, we don't use yadi. We just use or tarhi also, just chet. So bhavan patati chet. So if you read, then Uttirana Bhavishyati, then you pass. Then same thing, Yadi Pa Mitrani Gram, this sentence is also written here. Yadi Mitrani Gram Agachanti Tardi Pustakam Pathamaha. So there, there, that also, so Yadi Tardi is removed, and then here Mitrani Gram Agachanti, after that first part, we are putting chet. Just one word. Mitrani Brahma Agachanti Chet Pustakam Pathamaha. So, so this is important to note many times uh, the mistakes happen that we tend to use Yadi in the beginning and then use Chet, which is incorrect. If you use Yadi, then we need to use Tarhi. Then if you use Chet, then we should not use Yadi. So, Yadi Bhavan Patiti Chet Uttirana Bhavishyati. So sometimes that tendency, uh, mistake happens. But just be careful. So if you use Yadi, continue using Tarhi. If you want to use Chet, don't use Yadi. Guru Pathayati Chet, uh, next one, Jnanam Bhavati. So this part is clear, last one. Guru Pathayati Chet Jnanam Bhavati. So if he teaches, then we get the knowledge. Uh, knowledge happens, Jnanam Bhavati. No Chet, no Chet means if not. No Chet is used for if not. No, no, this is additional, whatever you can say. No Chet Jnanam Na Bhavati. So similarly, I'm here also, Mitra, Mitrani Graham Agachanti Chet Pustakam Pathamaha. No Chet Na Pathamaha. Otherwise, no Chet means otherwise. We won't. Same thing, Yadi Vrishti Bhavati Chet. Hmm, see, that Chet is not correct here because Yadi, I used Yadi. Vrishti Bhavati Chet, Vrishti Bhavati Chet. Kridamaha, hmm. no chet, chitram pashyamaha. So you can use anything else. Rushti hmm. bhavati chet, bahihi kridamaha, no chet, chitram pashyamaha. Atrasthi. Uh, no, no is na and 
नो इज नॉट एंड ना इज नो बोथ आर नो एक्चुअली नो जस्ट नो इज ऑल्सो यूज एज अ नो इन संस्कृत बट नो चेत इज यूज एज एज टूगेदर हिर् टू इंडिकेट अदरवाइज नो चेत एंड दिस नस्ट लाइक नस्ट टू इन प्लेस ऑफ नो यू कैन यूज एनी थिंग फॉर एक्सापल दिस इज गिवन यूर लाइक हिमपात होती चेत अत्र ठा इफ स्नो फॉल हापन then i stay here no chet otherwise graham gachami i go you do something else always no should be there it is not like that if with no chet otherwise what you want to do so that you can add anything here so here it means just otherwise no guru paathate chet gyanam bhavati otherwise not if guru teaches we get the knowledge otherwise not otherwise you can add anything eva pata bhavati che tat prishthami brahm no chet gam gachami so this is shown here with yadi we should not use chet we should use tarhi okay निर्मला भगनी चेतनो चेत ने वाक्य प्रयोग मोदय जय मोदय no chet can be added later but just with the chet first vrishti mm-hmm. bhavati chet maapanam gachami maapanam na gachami no chet graham vishtami No, that is the reverse, right? Rishti bhavati chet apanam na gachami. No chet apanam gachami. No chet apanam gachami. So the next one, there is a Yataha. So here there are some sentences using Yataha. And then convert that using, oh, sorry, Ataha. Amba Gruhe Nasti, Ataha, Balakha, Rodhiti. So you have to just change it to using Yataha. So what is the example here? First one. अंबा गृहे नालक रोदी सो बालक रोदी वि पुट इट फस्ट बालक रोदी यंबा गृहे नास्त मीन दे फोर यता मीन बिकॉज सो अंबा गृहे नास्त मदर इज नाट एट होम अतः गृम बालक रोदी दे फोर द बॉय क्राइज द बॉय क्राइज बिकॉज we want to say why cries because because mata grahe nasti so we want to say balakah roditi yatah amba grahe nasti so this should be simple just you have to use this and then yatah then this first part so removing yatah so in place of atah you put yatah hmm First you put this balaka rodhiti yataha amba grahe nasti. So ratrihi bhavati ataha sa saha nidrati. So here what happens? So does that mean whenever the boy cries, whenever the mother is not at home? 
No, no, we, we looked at Yata Hatha, right? Because, Yata means because, Atta means therefore. Whenever is was the Yada, right? Yada Tada. Yada Tada is whenever, then, when then. Yada, Yada Ambagruhe Nasti, Tada Balaka Roditi. So that is different. Now here we are using Yataha Ataha because therefore. Hmm. Okay, Jay Mode, what is the second one? Ratrihi Bhav. Saha Nidrati hmm. Yataha Ratrihi Bhavati. Hmm. So like this. This is our simple one. Sir. And there are examples of Yadi Tarfi. So here Chet is used in place of, in this sentences, we need to use Yadi Tarfi. Amba Gruhe Nasti Chet Balakaha Na Roditi. Amba Gruhe Nasti Chet Balakaha Roditi. Na Roditi. So we want to use Yadi Tarfi. So how does it become now? Yadi Amba Gruhe Asti Yadi Amba Gruhe Asti Balaka Tarhi Balaka Naroti So yeah, just remove Chet and then put Yadi here and in wherever there is a Chet there you put, there you put Tarhi Yadi Gitam Gayami Tarhi Sahanidrati Yadi Aragyam Samek Nasti Tarhi Vaidyam Pashatu Yadi Bahi Atapaha Asti Tarhi Madhavatu You can complete this. All right, so this is the last page in the pay, in the book, I think. And some word meanings in that, okay. So here there is a short story, Yadatada Aditari, using this, complete the story. Okay. So we'll complete this now. Before that, can do Subhashitam. Annadanam. Mahasharada, hmm. you have to read this. Hmm. Subhashitam. Punam. Danam. Oh dear, that letter. Vida Dananam. Ataha. Param, hmm. second line. Anayam, Srinaka, Tu, Tu Pateha, Tu Pateha, no, I don't, I'm sorry, that is a P, T, R, Tra, Pateha, Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yava Jajan Ni Dam Cha Vi Daya Gavaya. Good. So, just a few things here. This is what is the first one? Anandanam. Hmm. So, so the other one thing in the pronunciation is wherever there is a like a da, like this is da, right? Yes. So the da has to pronounce with the a, open the mouth. A, wide, open the mouth wide. Oh. Anna da, da nam, anna da nam, like, like, uh, we had it like Shiva, Shivananda. So even in pronunciation also, this is a typical 
change of pronunciation style in the English speakers and the, the actual in the Sanskrit and other. A is uh, contracted as a oh. So in English, speaking, yeah. which uh, which is not the right way. So wherever there is a R written here, there is a difference between the and the, right? Yes. Okay. So when pronouncing the with the a, there is it short, and when it, there we are not opening the mouth that much. Like if it's like just like a dana, dana. Here though we are not opening the mouth dana. Uh, but when we say, want to say da na da, we want to open the mouth like when you say Shivananda, it's not Shivananda, Shivananda. Yes. Now, another example. Uh, uh, like uh, Hima. This is another one which we all the time we hear. With my kids also, because they are uh, English speaking here. So, what is this one? How do you say this? Well, ma. No, no, total, ma. entire word. Hmm. Oh, Himalaya. Huh? Himalaya. So, here, you see, see this, it is Himalaya. Stop there. Ma. Means, uh, stop means uh, extend it. Hima. Himalaya. Himalaya. Yeah. Hima, oh. open there. Himalaya. Himalaya. So, with the, many times it changed to Himalaya. 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 Stop there. Uh, what is this one then? Okay, read this. Um, maha mm. ba baha rata. Mm, this is bha, this is fine. So together what it becomes? Maha ba barata. Yeah, maha bharata. Mm, barata. Indian. What is this? Shma ya na. So no. the ma would be long a. No, it is not sa, sa ra. Mm. Oh, it's ra. Rama yana. Ah. Rama yana. So those. Here the long, these are long, like we have to open the mouth really wide here, Ramayana. So Ramayana. Many times we hear this in the western area, we say Ramayana, Ramayana. Yes, Ramayana. 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 Story of Rama. Ramayana. Thank you. That's that's good. Thank you. And here we have Annadanam Param Param Danam. And I'm seeing some difficulty here in pronunciation here. So this one, this one is nothing but <coughs> hmm. so how do you say this one? Vidaya. Uh, so here this is a consonant. Mm. It's a consonant. Yes. So if I write it in using Roman, this is how I how I write actually here like this. So how do you say this now? There is no there no is a difference a. between there is no A. Mm. So these to be pronounced together. So that's Vidya. That that particular combination of D and Y always throws me. Yeah, yeah. Vidya. Vidya, correct, exactly. Yeah. So this only in the this is just the variation. This when it is written like this, it's just the writing style, uh, the script. So this Dya, 
is basically this the and wa, ya. Consonant the and then ya. So the same thing is written like this, just the writing script. Now if you can use the Roman script like this, and we use uh, Kannada script, Telugu script, other scripts are there. They are written differently, but this is the Devanagari script which looks like this, and it can also be written like this. If you write Vidya like this, it is the same thing, no problem. The pronunciation, pronunciation is important. How we say it is the main thing, whether you write, use any script you want. So here it is basically Vidya, which you already vidya. said. Hmm. So with the stop and then immediately say yeah with yeah. With yeah. Yep. Hmm. And then with Dhanam. Yeah. Dhanam. Dhanam. Annena and this one. Is that the the one with the key? <laughs> or she's just the S? It is a. Uh, it is in if you again just like this dya if you split this it is just a style of writing if you split this it becomes a consonant ka and shya okay. so when you pronounce this together how does it sound like ka sha sha yeah sha sha so in roman equivalent i think there is no equivalent but just like it is written like this. Cha, cha. Uh, Annena, Kshanika, and here is it, Truptihi. Truptihi. And. Tr tr oh, R. Okay. Truptihi. Truptihi. It is not basically R, it is a Ru, right? It is a Ru vowel. There is a difference between R and Ru. Oh. So here we have Ru. Truptihi. And uh, like Krishna, yeah, Krishna, yeah, yeah, Ruya, like Truptihi, Yavad Jeevam, this is double J, Yavad Jeevam Cha Vidyaya. Anyone want to, this is a simple one, you want to say Mangala Bhagani, you want to explain this? Meaning? Anadhanam param dhanam vidyadhanam ataha param. Anadhana is greater than vidyadhana. Mm -hmm. Annena Kshanika Tripti Yava Jeevam Cha Vidya. Knowledge gives permanent uh, uh, contentment, whereas hmm. Annam gives temporary hmm. contentment. Yeah, good. So, Annadanam Paramdanam. Param is a great. So, Annadanam, doing a. Uh, what did you say for Annadanam? Mm. What Mahodaya I forgot? And uh, the content, the uh -huh. Anadana means distributing food, food. Uh, giving away food, donating food or giving away f giving food to somebody is great. Mm -hmm. Paramdana means it's yeah, it's great. It's it's great uh, giving giveaway. Vidyadana Mathaparam, but. Vidya, but is not there. But Vidya, um, giving the knowledge is even great or greater. Annena chanika truptihi. Yeah, you said right. Annena, by food, just a temporary satisfaction or content, contentment. Yavat jivam cha vidya. Yavat, no, here yavat is used. Yavat jivam. Until or until life means lifelong. Uh, that is permanent. Hmm, permanent. Yeah, but you, okay. Yeah. So you the greater uh, 
when it comes to giving giving food gives less uh, is no is less great i mean uh, we, giving knowledge is greater than giving food and uh, food gives temporary contentment whereas knowledge gives permanent yeah content yeah so here tripti hai what is the lingam of tripti hai pulinga idu pulingam how do we know विसर्ग 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 डॉलेज इंडिकेट लिंगम लाइक लक्ष्मी 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 इज अ दीर्घ लक्ष्मी वह दीर्घ लक्ष्मी लक्ष्मी ही दीर्घ पुलिंग स्त्रीलिंग नपुंसकिंग आलो सो ओनली दर्ड्स वी हेव नोन सो फार आर फोकस्ड इज लाइक राम दुलिंग अकार अंत पुलिंग देर विसर्ग इज कमिंग फैन बट नाट द everywhere it is not true and the reverse is also the same no don't expect that visarga will be there for all the pullingas all pullingas will be having all the pullingas will have going to have visarga so those that is not depends on the word to word now shanika is hmm three linga hmm so we can guess it is tripti is also trailing yeah exactly so here we can guess tripti hi one which uh, the ending in e here the base word is ending in e visarga is there but the base word is tripti which could be any linga like it could be pullinga for example kavi we have kavi hi hari hi and but we have three linga words also like mati hi uh, kriti hi bhakti hi etc so how do you know that but here it is easy to spot because there is a kshanika kshanika is we know that is trilingam because a ah, there is no pullinga word ending in a ah, that is for sure in sanskritam uh is that correct no actually there is no trilinga word ending in a ah, that is the right thing to say there could be but here we know kshanika is a visheshanam that's why we know kshanika kshanika etc we know by the way there is there are in sanskritam there are pullinga words ending base words pullinga words ending in a in sanskritam but there are no base words in sanskritam which are trilinga ending in a just clarification but here it is easy to spot kshanika because kshanika is a visheshanam and it is like a kshanika is all pullinga kshanika is trilinga like where that uttirna uttirna like that so here we know that chupti is trilinga like bhakti mati shakti like they are all trilinga words <laughs> okay simha moshaka hacha Hmm. Anyone want to read this? Okay. Who is the new newcomer to the class? Want to read this? You know, Bagini. I can try. Yeah. Um. वने वने एक सिंह बसती सॉरी 
मूषकम हस्तेना मूषकम हस्तेन गृहतवान he caught a with his hand he caught a moshaka moshaka is a mouse mouse hmm. anantaram moshaka mahodeva what is it ekada ekam ah ekada means once or once. once upon a time like ekada once saha sometime once ekam moshakam one mouse hastena grihitavan मूषक भयात पंचमी तो यह पंचमे भक्ति तो मूषक भयात उत्तवान बिकॉज ऑफ और बाय फ्रॉम फ्रॉम फियर आउट ऑफ फियर He said, "Oh, Moshaka, the mouse." Mm-hmm. Okay, what did he say? Boh, boh, ho, that. Vana, vana raja. Hmm. Krupaya, mom. Hmm. Moon, moon. Hmm. Munchatu. 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 So where the visarga is there, visarga is should not be pronounced like a separate her. So it is just like a continuation of the last previous uh, swara, previous what is the swara vowel? Hmm. Previous vowel. Like a previous vowel is o here. Yeah. So bho. Then after that is the visarga. So just continue with that o. Bho. 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 कंप्लीट द सेंटेंस फॉर अहम ओह ओके अहम भवत तह उप उपकारम कशो कशे कशेमी करोमी करोमी या दे लुक सिमिलर शाइन्स रा या करोमी सॉरी मीनिंग ऑफ दिस सेंटेंस भवान अहम उपकारम करोमी तो उपकार इज फेवर तो भवान मा मुंचति भवान मा मुंचति मींस ओके भवान मा मुंचति means uh you release me you release munchati release you release me aham bhavatah upakaram karami i will do a favor to you for you so what do you want to put there in the dash in english you release me dash dash you release me dash dash i'll do a favor in english and, what and huh? and 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 what is the first one here 
Just as you release me, and I do a favor to you. If. Uh, if. So if when the if comes, generally we want to, then here. Then yeah. Uh, if Baba, if you release me, then I will do a favor to you. So now equivalent. What is the Sanskritam? Yeah. So there is a list of uh, words given here. Yada tada yadi tari yatha tatha va chet no chet yadi pitatapi. Hmm. Jai Mahadev, what do you put in? Yadi Tarri. Yadi Bhavan Maa Munchati Tarri Aham Bhavataha Upakaram Karoni. Yadi, if Tarri, then. Hmm. Okay, next sentence. Simhaha Uttavana. He. He was right. He Mushaka. And then Bhavataha Gatram. Hmm. Last time Bhavataha Chintanam. First you have to understand the meaning. Mm-hmm. Hey Mushaka, hey mouse. Bhavataha Gatram. Your Gatram means mm. size. Oh. Your size dash dash Bhavataha Chintanam. You are you are thinking. Your size, your thinking. Dash dash your size, dash dash your thinking. Mm-hmm. Bhavata. A, A Moshaka. A, it is addressed to the mouse. Yeah. A mouse. Dash dash your size, dash dash your thinking. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mashaarda. Yeah. Yeah. Or do you want to put um, that in the, fill in the blank? I was trying to think, because of your size, what are you thinking? No, but, but in this sentence there is no question, it is just a statement. Oh. So, hey, mouse, dash dash your size, dash dash your thinking. Uh. Yes, Jai Mahadeva already said it. Anybody did you hear? No. Anyone else? Then Malavi. Mangalavi. He said Yatha Tatha. He Moshaka, Yatha Bhavata Gatram, as your size is there, Tatha Bhavata Chintanam. That way is your thought. So, Moshaka is so he's small. saying that because the mouse is small, he doesn't have a very good thought? Yeah, you oh. think small, because your uh, size is small. Mahudaya, you, your size is small, and uh, so you, you're small-minded, correct? Yeah, right, right. You also think like a yeah. tiny. Yeah. You, size is small, so is your thinking. Yeah, so you're correct. Yes. Mm, exactly. Then dash dash. Okay, next one. Who wants to continue reading? Mm. Then what are we will read next? Mm-hmm. Dash dash. Mm. Mm. Dash bhavata kimapi mama prayojanam nasti dash bhavantam manchami. Hmm. Dash dash bhavata kimapi mama prayojanam nasti dash dash bhavantam unchami. So here what is the meaning? Like how? Bhavata means by you. Hmm. Kimapi mama prayojanam nasti. I don't have any use of you. Hmm. Prayojanam is use. Hmm. Hmm. So there is no use of you for me dash dash bhavantam unchami i release you yadyapi tatapi ah yadyapi mama prayojan nasti tathapi bhavantam unchami is it yataha atah one go there you can use yataha also 
Uh, that's why Ataha is not given in that list. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. And that's okay. Yeah, yeah, you can use Yatha also. That's an independent thought. So, Moshakaha Tataha Palayanam Krutavan. Next, what happens? Moshaka Tataha Palayanam Krutavan means? Palayanam means? Running away. It ran away from there. Ran away. Moshaka ran away from there. Tataha means from there. Next. Ekata Vyagasya Vyagasya Vyada. Vyadasya Jale Chimaha Patitavan. Jale Jale. Jale means net. Hmm. Ekada once hmm. Vyadasya Jale Simaha Patitavan. Sasya Bahu Pida Abavat. Hmm. Dash Saha Uchai Garjitavan. Hmm. So dash is how it's a hegar It's just a sentence with one fill in the blank. Hmm. So Tasya Bahu Pira Bhavat. So he he experienced a lot of pain. A lot of pain happened to him. Then sa dash dash saha uchahi garjitavan. So what uh, what we want to put there? Uchahi he roared. He made a sound, loud sound. Then so what he'll put? Tarhi saha vichayi garjitavan. Then, tarhi is then. Tarhi, tarhi is not then actually. So we can use tada here. Tada. Tada. Saha vichayi garjitavan. Sorry, chet what do you mean? Chet will be in that case, no? Which one? Chet. Not Chet. Chet is Chet and Tarid is coming where there is a condition. Conditional. Okay. Hmm. Next one. Yada Tamasya Gardenam Shutavan. Sada Mushakaha Tatra Agatavan. Yada, Timasya Karjanam Shrutavan, Tada, Mushaka Tatra Agatavan. When? Then. When Garjanam? When he heard Sima's lion's roar, then Mouse came there. Okay, next. Simaha Mushakam Shrutavan. Bhavan Shankram Jalam Shigram Jalam Partayati Aham Bahi Agachami Hm. Shakam of Tavan. The chet is okay, no more Chet is good, yeah. Bhavan Shigram Jalam Karteti Chet. If you cut uh, if you cut the if you cut the net quickly, mm. then in that case I'll come out quickly. Mm. Then next. Mm. Yadaha Gachami. No chet. Ah, no chet. Ah, no chet. Good. No chet Yadaha Gachati. Good. Otherwise, Vyadhaya comes there. Sada Mushakaha Dante na Jalam Kartitavan Simmaha Jalat Bahihi Agatavan Saha Uttavan Bhavan Mama Mitram Gatram Alpam Brahat Dash Bhavatu Gatram is size. Gatram alpam brahat. Small, big, dash bhavatu. 
Sarhi Bhavatu. No. So look at the list there again. Gatram Alpam. Rahat. Yatta Bhavatu. Hmm? No, not Yatta. Anybody? Jai Mother? Va? ಕ್ವಾಲಿಟಿ <laughs> 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 Okay, any question on this, Masharada? Any doubts? Um, well, I was going to just keep looking up the words later. Uh, Vyadaha is a... Uh, it's, it's like, so the mouse city is going to scare off a lion? Sorry, say that again. Is the mouse was going to scare off a lion? No, no. There was... There was two different stories that they were connecting. I was trying to figure out the connection. Hmm. Who wants to summarize this? Mangala Bhagani want to summarize the story? Uh, the lion is caught in a net and the mouse is uh, cutting the net off to release the lion. That's the story. Oh. Yeah, but can you just what happened in the well, first The mouse cut the net? Oh. Yes. He chewed it. So it helping each other hmm. and therefore he does have that's why he was telling the man he would help him because he does have big ideas so yeah so this uh ಸಿಂಹ So, uh, let me share. This story, I have, I had uh, made it a video, the same story. Oh, cute. I'll, I'll send you the link if, if you want to watch it. same story uh, so you can visually see with, with the captions let me just a moshakah cha sanskruta tatha vane ekah simhah vasati so you can also turn tah nidram karoti there is also closed captions subtitles are available you want to watch kachit moshakah tatra ಆಗಿ ಮೂಷಕ ಉಪರಿ ಕ್ರೀಡತಿ ನಿದ್ರಾಭಂಗಿಸ್ಟಿಕೇಟೆಡ್ today the book is complete so we are, so we are technically at the end so the few in between there are some homework at uh, exam the exercises you can complete next week and next week also i wish to meet one last uh, meeting if and we can revise 
other subjects or chapters which you covered just quickly on the topics. And if you have any doubts, also we can questions we can discuss them. Otherwise, we will be officially closing the course next week. Oh.